Hi, welcome to a Gallum Lab tutorial for recovering Networker after system failure. This will be performed with Networker Virtual Edition 19.2 and Data Domain 6.2. Let's start with launching our Networker console. We can see our policies here. Let's identify that we have the correct storage pool on our backup policy. Make sure this is the correct pool for your storage device. Let's also take note of our storage pool identification. Click on Devices. Take note of your device name. Steps to perform after a system failure has occurred. Step 1. Build a new networker. And step 2. Attach it to the same storage as the previous networker. Here is our new networker attached to the original storage, in this case a data domain. Click on devices and make sure to have the same device name as the previous instance. Going through all our workflows, we can see that our previous configurations are no longer there and that our destination pool has not been set. Steps to perform via SSH on the new networker instance. If you have email notifications configured, you will most likely have an email resembling this one from a previous backup. This contains the bootstrap SSID and device name. The one at the bottom is the most recent backup available on your storage device. You will need this information in the following steps. If you do not have these configured, don't worry. We will show you how to access these without emails. If you want email notifications, refer to our video on the topic. Connect to your networker via SSH and use the sudo su command. If you do not know your SSID, use the command scanner minus capital B and your device name. Now that you have your SSID, use the command scanner minus M minus capital S, your SSID and your device name. Getting this output and seeing the same SSID you entered at the bottom means it successfully found your backup. Now enter NSRDR. Select yes. Put in your SSID. Since we want to recover the full networker, we said yes to all the following prompts. Using mminfo minus av, we can see all our backups from our previous networker, including our client backups. We can see our client names, SSIDs, and whether or not we did a full or incremental backup. Using mminfo minus b, we can now see all our previous bootstraps. the most recent one being at the bottom. Final verification in Networker using the UI. Here in Policies, we can see our configurations have been restored. We have our backup workflow for our clients, and our destination pools have been restored.
Thank you for watching. For more information, please contact us.